Hello and welcome to A4 Arsenal. My name is Daksh and welcome to another video on the channel. What the hell is happening at Chelsea? You know, Chelsea me Graham Potter sack hua. Everyone thinks it's a great decision and I think mera bhi yehi manna tha ki Potter ka sack hona is a legitimate decision. He wasn't doing well. The atmosphere got really toxic. The players started feeling disconnected with the ideas of Potter and pitch pe to result aahi nahi rahe the. So Potter ko sack hona yaar it made sense. Um then you know you had your replacement so sabse pehle Saldor Bruno Saldor um ko interim manager banaya and then they played that game against Liverpool yesterday which by the way was the probably one of the worst games i've ever seen um uske baad se in the background awaazein chal rahi thi that Julian Nagelsmann uh, Nagelsmann would be the next Chelsea manager um a lot of Chelsea fans were very confident in Nagelsmann's coming to Chelsea um today morning it was reported that Luis Enrique Lucho was in London um without naming any club but he was in London his representatives were in London to negotiate his next job and it everyone thought chal okay fine nagelsman is not coming maybe it's going to be lucho and then you know i started thinking if fine lucho also makes a little more sense than nagelsman because chelsea have already tried a manager who is upcoming young um, not that well known but great potential in potter um and they already suffered so maybe nagelsman ke sath bhi same fears the that he's too young maybe not that experienced and they wanted to go for an experienced man than manager in lucho but then talk sport ne break ki news that frank lampard might make a shock return to chelsea and i was like okay this is talk sport talk sport don't don't believe talk sport and then over time other jacob steinberg um started reporting some other journalists started reporting that frank lampard is in conversations with chelsea i was like hold on wait a minute what is happening and then david ornstein um probably one of the most respected journalists on all clubs in the premier league uh reported that frank lampard is close to agreeing a short term deal with chelsea um uh, which would put him on an interim contract interim head coach position with a contract till june so it's a short term contract but frank lampard and i was like this is not happening i almost of course laughed and everything then fabrizio ne confirm kar diya and now it looks like um confirmation from two top journalists onstein and romano that it is going to be frank lampard who will be joining chelsea on an interim manager's um role now in this video we'll try and figure out why why chelsea is hiring frank lampard um in this interim role because it doesn't really make sense right you sacked lampard to bring in tuchel who you sacked to bring in potter who you sacked to bring in lampard so it's it's doesn't really make sense and mai bahut hasa tha in sab meme karenge and nahi aata and apart from the memes in this video we will talk about why chelsea are looking to use and sign frank lampard in this position so reason number 1 a uh, sabse pehla reason where i think frank lampard is coming in to chelsea is because i think this season is a write off um there is zero downside and zero upside and frank lampard ke aane se the atmosphere at stamford bridge would be kafi less, less toxic if you talk to any chelsea fan they would tell you that um the time period under frank lampard when he was chelsea manager before was one of the most enjoyable times as a chelsea fan because यूथ पे काफी रिलायंस हो रहा था मेसन माउंट की इमरजेंस रीस जेम्स एंड टैमी एब्राहम के अंडर जब आप फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड की मैनेजमेंट देखते थे काफी एक्साइटिंग लगता था एंड फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड इज अ चेल्सी लेजेंड यार जब एक लेजेंड ऑफ योर क्लब स्टार्ट अज्यूमिंग चार्ज थिंग्स हैव टू गो रियली रियली बैड फॉर देम टू गेट सैट विच हैपन इन फ्रैंक्स फर्स्ट टेन ईयर अभी चेल्सी का बहुत बुरा टाइम चल रहा है फैंस are not believing in the club atmosphere bada toxic hai stadium pe boos wagera hoti hai so frank ke aane se frank lampard ke aane se atmosphere kafi improve hoga players will respect the manager a little more because he knows about the standards of chelsea he knows what playing for chelsea should mean and he can motivate the players etc piche se saath mein background mein uh boli ekbali vivel and jitne bhi sporting directors wagera jo bhi hain they can continue this search away from the public eye तो अब क्या होगा कि आपको हर गेम में ओनर्स पे नहीं चलेगा ओनर्स 
नया मैनेजर लाओ ओनर्स नया मैनेजर लाओ आपने इस सीजन के लिए किताब बंद कर दी है इस सीजन आप फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड को ला चुके हो चेल्सी पे इस सीजन में नया मैनेजर लाने के लिए कोई अब जल्दी नहीं है नाउ दे कैन डू देर रिसर्च इन पीस विदाउट एवर बींग प्रेशराइज इन टू मेकिंग अस्टी डिसीजन विच वुड दे वुड हैड टू मेक अगर ब्रूनो सैल्डो या ग्रैम पॉटर अभी भी जॉब में होते सो विद असाइनमेंट ऑफ फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड एज द इंटरम हेड कोच यू हैव डिसाइडेड वॉट्स गोइन हैप इन द सीजन दैट दिस सीजन इज अ राइट ऑफ फ्रैंक विल जस्ट ट्राई टू गेट लिटिल बिट ऑफ पॉजिटिविटी फ्रॉम द फैंस एंड कुछ अचीव करने का नहीं है रेलिकेट भी नहीं करना है जस्ट एज लॉन्ग एज द फैंस फॉल इन लव विद द क्लब अगेन इवन ए लिटिल बिट बिकॉज ऑफ फ्रैंक्स प्रेजेंस ये बहुत अच्छी बात हो जाएगी सो आई थिंक दिस इज द रीजन नंबर वन दैट चेल्सी आर अपॉइंटिंग फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड रीजन नंबर टू वेर आई थिंक चेल्सी हैज अपॉइंटेड फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड इज अ लिटिल कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ रीजन नंबर वन कि यार जो इन्होंने इतने इंटरव्यूज करे हैं चेल्सी ने फ्रॉम नागल्स मैन लुइस एंड रीक है इनफैक्ट अभी तो एक दो रिपोर्ट्स आ रही हैं अनकन्फर्म्ड है दैट कॉन्ट इज ऑल्सो इन कॉन्वर्सेशन विद चेल्सी बट आई थिंक इन इंटरव्यूज में चेल्सी हायरार की इतनी इंप्रेस हो गई है फ्रॉम बोथ नागल्स मैन एंड लूचो दैट दे वॉन्ट टू डू फर्दर इंटरव्यूज इन फर्दर इन्वेस्टिगेशन और मे बी इवन सी सम अदर मैनेजर्स दैट माइट बी इंटरेस्टेड इन टेकिंग ओवर एट चेल्सी फॉर द लॉन्ग टर्म सो मे बी इट्स जस्ट दैट द अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ मैनेजर्स मे बी सम मैनेजर है सैड मे बी यू शुड वेट फॉर द समर एंड देन वी कैन हैव ग्रेट कॉन्वर्सेशन अबाउट दिस और आई एल बी ओपन टू वर्किंग फॉर चेल्सी इन द समर तो ईदर इट्स जस्ट दैट द मैनेजर्स दे हैव इंटरव्यूड लाइक लूचो एंड नागल्स मैन हैव इम्प्रेस दम सो मच दैट दे नीड अ लिटिल मोर टाइम एंड दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू बी रश्ड इन टू अ डिसीजन एंड ऑल्सो इट्स पॉसिबल दैट सम मैनेजर मे बी लाइक एन एंचे लॉटी हैज सेट की आई विल मेक माई फाइनल डिसीजन इन द समर सो यू शुड वेट फॉर मी इन द समर तो उन्होंने क्या किया चेल्सी लेजेंड हु विल नॉट से नो टू द क्लब अ चेल्सी लेजेंड हुज मैनेज बिफोर एंड चेल्सी लेजेंड हु नोज वट द क्लब इज अबाउट उसको हायर कर लिया ताकि इस सीजन पे किसी को हायर करने का प्रेशर नहीं बने फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ट के साथ आधी फैन बेस वुड बी लाइक ये एक इंस्पिरेशनल साइनिंग नहीं है सो दे माइट बी डिसअपॉइंटेड विद लैम्पर्ट बट आधा फैन बेस विल बी हैप्पी टू सी फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ट एट द ब्रिज देखो अगर आपने किसी भी चेल्सी फैन को पिछले टू थ्री मंथ्स में देखा है यू हैव सीन दैम डिवॉइड ऑफ होप डिवॉइड ऑफ एनी सॉर्ट ऑफ इंस्पिरेशन सो दे स्टार्टेड लुकिंग फॉर इंस्पिरेशन इन द मैनेजर बट थोड़ी पॉजिटिविटी आ जाएगी फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ट के आने से The third reason where I think Frank Lampard has been appointed as interim is that Chelsea board doesn't know what to do. They have no clue how to run the club, and this is, of course, a little bit memeable and a negative reason. And I think it's very unlikely that this is the reason. But let's just explore it. I think Chelsea's hierarchy is in full panic mode. They did not expect that their plan for transfers will not work out their plan for the manager will not work out and this backlash from the fans has genuinely taken a back todd bowley and clear lick um so they have gone full appeasement mode um and they are trying to salvage the situation but they really have no clue what to do maybe they have spoken to managers and the managers have after those meetings told them that i am not interested because this 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 is reason so you know what it could be that Bolly just doesn't know what to do, and they have just gone full appeasement, full PR mode. Because if you think about it, Frank Lampard's coming is what is the upside? Hai? There is no upside. What do you want to do? What is his direction? It will be very difficult to figure out. Karne aapko, yaar. I mean, I could only literally think of two positive reasons why Frank Lampard was hired, but it's also equally possible, maybe. that the board doesn't know what it's doing but i will give the board the benefit of doubt these guys run sports enterprises they know what it is now they are putting people who are familiar of the game of football in charge in vivel and the sporting co sporting directors jo bhi hain um maybe frank lampard shayad say guys at the end he is just a stabilizing force before someone else comes in to take chelsea in that next step but what a week man ग्रैम पॉटर सैक हुआ टूकल बायन चला गया सब लोग सोच रहे थे अरे अगर नागल्स में ना गया चेल्सी में तो नागल्स मैन वर्सेज टूकल हो जाएगा चैंपियंस लीग में एंड नाउ वी आर एंडिंग अप विद फ्रैंक लैम्पर्ड एट चेल्सी इट्स एब्सोल्यूटली क्रेजी व्हाट हैपेंस इन फुटबॉल मैन एंड दिस इज वाई आई लव द प्रीमियर लीग ऑलवेज सम ड्रामा और दी अदर विच इज कॉन्स्टेंटली हैपनिंग इन द लीग एंड कांट एवर स्टॉप 
reading about this league and following this league but what do you guys think about frank lampard's appointment i honestly am shocked i am grateful that it's only a short term thing agar aap chelsea fan ho um it just hope that frank lampard doesn't do an ole gunner salshare and convinces the board to hire him full time again because then this cycle will keep repeating and repeating man um the only thing that could top this is like chelsea go for andre villas boas or chelsea go for jose mourinho 3.0 although to be honest jose will not be a bad signing but yeah let me know what you think about frank lampard returning at chelsea all but confirmed um imagine tomorrow morning you wake up and they say frank lampard is now not in the running kuch bhi ho sakta hai chelsea ke sath it's a very unreliable what a funny and strange club to follow but it is what it is thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video please like the video i really appreciate it and yeah See you all soon.